Wow, what a badass Uke. Looks like Felix has fallen in love again with Isaac. Same Felix, same. What you're feeling right now and your yeah. expression is exactly what I'm doing when I saw Isaac in this chapter. I just have to say though, Felix is such an Isaac simp. I mean, I mean not only him because let's be real here. I love how we're all simping for the Omega rather than the Alpha in this series. Before we get started, I just want to remind our viewers that if you like seeing more Yaoi content and would like to support this channel, please don't forget to smash that like button. Also, if you haven't done so, please subscribe to this channel and hit that notification bell. Feel free to message me in my Twitter or Instagram at sealedforjoshi, which I'll be using to interact with viewers about more Yaoi content. If that's something that interests you, feel free to follow me at sealedforjoshi. Finally, this video will contain explicit content and a lot of manual spoilers. With that in mind, please proceed with caution. You have been warned. Now, without further ado, let's jump into chapter 27 of Dear Benjamin. Isaac is a little bad bitch, but for real. In this series, Isaac appears more attractive to me and hot, hotter than Felix. I've been reading a lot of Yahweh for several years now and I never actually thought of an Uke as sexually appealing because I prefer the Seme who's really masculine versus the Uke who's usually more softer than the Seme but man Felix's Pikachu face when Isaac went full on Black Widow on the enemy. I love it. Especially when Isaac pulled out the big gun. This chapter was so intense because in my head, I can totally see it turn into an action movie. Total big dick energy. Even Felix blushed because yes, somehow Isaac looked more handsome than anyone when he's shooting people. Go Isaac! <laughs> I gotta say though that I we all know that we yeah. can all agree that Isaac is really hot but I can't help getting chills from the shooting posture that Isaac has. Sad that his circumstances and his chances of having a simple and free life is not easy. So it's really hard to foster a relationship with Felix, but you know, I'm pretty sure that this series will take us to that journey, how they can foster a healthy relationship together. But um, oh my god, it's so freaking hot, um, especially when Isaac was trying to protect his plants. in all of the things that was going on in this chapter i really thought that he was protecting his plants and then when he got the weapons from the pot yeah. i'm like oh my god he's such the bag baddest omega there is and i also want to protect his plants <laughs> man i can't believe how isaac stole my heart with this chapter but I'm not complaining, you know. I think like Isaac is just built differently than any Omegas out there. He's a bad bitch, <laughs> you know. Makes you question, who's the alpha now, bitch? <laughs> Isaac seriously made Felix look like a damsel in distress in this chapter. <laughs> but still, Felix is the cutest semi ever he worships isaac like an idiotic kid like i said he's a simp <laughs> and i just want to point out another thing that i found really funny in this chapter um there's a page in the in this chapter where you know it kind of um isaac was asking felix to cover him 
And I was like, oh my God, Felix, what are you doing? Isaac told you to cover him, not stare at him with a blush, you know? But I really can't blame him because Isaac was so amazing in this chap chapter, yeah. but it also begs the question, Felix, why are you so useless? <laughs> anyway, um, I really feel like the more I see this chapter, I can't, I'm so excited on um, when Felix will find out that Benjamin is Felix's son. I mean, literally right now, I don't know like how he doesn't know because they are like copy and paste of each other. Even if they just take a mirror and look at it, hopefully he sees that, but I guess not. Like right now, he's just simping over Isaac, which I understand because Omega Supremacy. <laughs> But, you know, I really love the fact that this is not your typical boring basic yaoi and there is a lot of things to love in this series. Um, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Please don't forget to follow my social media to be teased about some of the boys' love that I'm interested in. Feel free to leave me a message and converse with me. I'd love to hear back from you. And also, please don't forget to support the author. All the manual details can be found in the description below. Again, thank you so much and hope to see you next time.